Hey everyone, um, today is October 21st. I keep on forgetting that. I actually had to redo this because I forgot to charge my damn laptop. So, um, I'm going to try to make this quick. This is actually about bipolar. And it's on the wrong side. Hang on. Um, oh, and this one actually scared the hell out of me. I'm not going to lie about this one. So I'm actually kind of scared to tell my therapist, which sucks. We had just made an agreement to, um, supposed to see her in two weeks instead of one week. Um, because I've made such improvement with the lithium, um, I'm able to regimen, I'm able to regimen myself with the meds, with the food, the meals, what do I do each day, this type of stuff. Um, which I do do something productive every day except for yesterday I think I mentioned that totally drove me nuts I can't not do something I, I have to do one thing each day um, just to feel active and I'm totally not even talking about what I want to because it's scaring me um, okay as you know I have voices or I just play hallucinations, voices sound scary. And, well, hallucinations sound even worse. Um, and a possible visual hallucination, same possible, because I'm not sure. Um, so, the last time that I heard voices, if I remember correctly, yeah, it was the 16th. And it was two separate, two separate voices. Um, as I mentioned, uh, the scariest one was when I was um, at the threshold of the room that was supposed to be my daughter's room, and there was this scary male voice saying "cow." Um, <laughs> yeah, I took a break from painting, as I mentioned. I did not do that after that happened. I took a long break and I think I stayed downstairs that day, which I never stayed downstairs. Um, today was different, actually. My um, husband and his nephew actually went out to the store. I say between 9 and 10 at night, I'm guessing on the time because I don't know. Um, I really don't. But um, I came down the first flight. And I turned onto the first, the second flight of stairs. And um, I stopped because I heard whispering. But it was like three different voices at the same time trying to whisper. And um, I stopped for a second and I'm like, no, it's just in my head. It's the pills I'm taking, they're not there, they're not real. Um, seriously, it, it kind of feels like a bad acid trip sometimes. Which I told my therapist that, and she kind of stared at me. I'm like, it's a bad acid trip. Like, sh I guess she's never taken acid. Um, so she doesn't know what it feels like. But, um... Okay, so I came downstairs, and I turned to go into the kitchen to finish the, finish the laundry downstairs in the basement. Um... Like, there's the stairs right here, and then, like, there's a big room, which is the living room, which is, you know, bright. I got the whole light on thing. I can't stay in the dark, by the way. Um, I think you guys know that. And, um, as I turned, I thought I saw someone standing, like, right at the beginning of the, f of the, f Right at the beginning of the French doors. I'm not going to panic. I'm not going to let it get a hold of me. And I'm not sure if it was actually a person. Or if it was the cabinet that's there standing. Because it's like a dark, dark, dark brown. Um, so that and I was... After my second lithium, I'm like totally out of my head. And I'm stoned. I'm sleepy. I get slap happy. Um... So I was slap happy when I went downstairs. Um, I'm hoping it was um, just a cabinet and like not actually um, 
a visual visual hallucination that would kind of suck because it means I can't take the lithium um, which means I'm probably not going to tell my therapist this um, anyways I did have uh, uh, auditory hallucinations um, there were three of them as I said and I got down to the bottom of the stairs and it was like right after I saw him and I started to go into the kitchen then I like heard I heard them all like right behind me um, the first voice says here she comes um, which was like twice um, then there's a who's who's that and a who she so I'm trying to remember I'm trying to I can't say it the way that it was said I know this sounds crazy um, I could if, if if there were three people here I could kind of give you an idea of like how it sounded okay so first there was a here she comes then it's who's that who she here she comes and it was like these like fast quick like people talking it sounded like people I mean, they've gotten worse at first it was a whisper type voice and like and now it's like they're really freaking there it's just, they're not really there but it sounds like there's somebody really there um So what I keep on telling myself is it's it's just in my head. It's because of the lithium. It'll pass after three months. <laughs> Mother fuck, man! I go like three goddamn months of this shit to mellow out, and I'm not damning God. I'm sorry. Um, three gosh darn months for this stuff to work. Um, for it to calm down. I see I'm getting freaked out. I know I look calm. I am terrified right now. I just just thinking about this crap again makes me scared. I didn't even like voices when I was doing drugs and getting high. They would freak me out. Now I'm sober. Mm. This is like fate. This bitch slapping the fuck out of me right now. That's what I think I really do. It's karma paying me back. Um, so as I said, my mood, I hope I said it in this one, I'm not sure. Uh, my mood is great, not great, I'd say like 70% good. Um, I'm more calm, mellow, docile, female. Um, <laughs> I'm slap happy, I'm sorry. Um, I'm actually taking my pills at a regimen each day, like times. I know what time to take what pill, when to do it, no problem with that. Um, food wise, I usually eat with the medication, so not too hard to figure that one out. And each day I try to do something. Um, today was laundry, bathroom, and I actually swept which kind of messed up my routine for tomorrow which is sweet bean and dusting so um but I try to do something each day so that I'm not just a complete couch bum home buddy not doing anything type thing um besides that my my anxiety has actually decreased a lot I am panicking my ass off right now it feels like about a three which is about as far as it goes like I can't get any any okay on a scale of 0 to 10 um, I'm at a 3 right now and I can feel the 3 I've, I feel like I'm kind of shaky inside right now fingers and toes feel kind of numb I feel a tiny bit dizzy but the messed up part is that because of my lithium I cannot go past the 3 I stop at the 3 it's like, oh, no, 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 no more. Just a three and you're done. Um, 
so it's really cool um, I've actually tried to push the limits with my anger two times last week I, I, mean, I pushed myself I tried to get angry and I got to like maybe a two and I'm like that's it and before this I'd be like a thousand in in a second I'd be like raging face red breaking everything and now it's like I just get kind of angry and frustrated so definitely helping with the mood with the anger with the anxiety the only downfall is the auditory hallucinations um which I've got a lot of comments and feedback saying that it passes with time especially with females um, it's a more common with them, so I've found out through all my messages or comments. Um, not so many males. Um, I did have one transgender, um, uh, I guess female, she's a female now, and she actually had the same problem, so, yeah, I think it's just girls that, like, tend to get it more than guys do so totally not lucky there um so hopefully in three months i'll be feeling better less anxious less paranoid with the voices type thing um and the messed up part is that my lithium was just upped this month if i remember correctly yes i got my book out um, it was up to October 2nd. So I got October, November, December, January. So I got till January 2nd to see if the voices decrease. Or actually to see how long. I don't know what to say. It's I'm freaking out right now. Just thinking about it. Um, after three months, it's supposed to calm down. So I hope it does. Um... I think I'm done because I'm freaking out and I have to go on stage and take a fucking shower. I'm sorry for cursing but I don't want to go down, I don't want to go downstairs. Um, anyways, um, I know this might have been kind of boring for people who, who don't hear voices <laughs> and for those who don't hear voices it might have been kind of entertaining. Um, I hope it was, <laughs> seriously I do. I want to make some people laugh at least. Um, so, thanks for watching. And um, I love the comments. I love the messages. You guys are awesome and very sweet. Thank you. So, I will probably check back, check back in tomorrow just to see if I'm doing better. Um, since, wait, I might do it Tuesday since no one's going to be home. Um, yeah. Because I have noticed that my voices tend to happen around triggers um, with my lithium. And the fact that my husband up and left with his nephew, like just at the drop of a hat for no reason, he was, oh, I'm going to the store, by poof, it kind of set me off. So I'm thinking, I might be thinking wrong, but I'm thinking that they might be associated with my triggers for anger or anxiety so I'll find out this week and see what's going on okay thanks for watching and have a great night or a great morning because I'm about to crash myself thank you bye